In this video, I will talk about aging, what is the mechanism of aging, and my viewpoint on aging is much different from other specialists. So, please, I want to make it clear what uh, I believe the mechanism and how we have to go to uh, define uh, aging, okay, so the way to internal, eternal use. So the agent process, as always, so you can download the presentation as a PDF file from the link in the description. I highly recommend you to do this so you can get more information. Then. So agent process is largely driven by the loss of elasticity in the extracellular matrix, which provides structural support for the cells in our body and the hardening of, uh, or stiffening of blood vessels. Again, this is my opinion much different from other people okay opinion of other people so you it's up to you to follow me and or believe official viewpoint or the uh, other people okay it's up to you what i i i, I do is this i make my own research and it is uh, so and from these ideas i uh, i recommend or i can use uh, some methods to rejuvenate my body or slow down aging and they eventually to live uh, forever young or 1,000 years young. Okay, then, okay, this uh, stiffening of the extracellular matrix and blood vessels uh, they persistently impairs blood circulation and causes low oxygen levels in tissues, known as chronic hypoxia. Under hypoxic conditions, cells switch to production of energy molecules ATP by anaerobic glycolysis, a less efficient process that does not require oxygen. Low oxygen levels also harm the mitochondria, the organelles that generate most of ATP in cells and lead to the increased production of reactive oxygen species. And these reactive oxygen species are unstable molecules that can damage proteins and cellular membranes in cells. As a con consequence of this damage, some cells undergo programmed uh, cell death or apoptosis or others enter the state of senescence or cellular aging. So this is a, a representation of the, uh, the extracellular matrix. It is again like a frame and living cells are attached to this fra frame. Mostly our body consists of this frame with some empty spaces which are filled by some liquid and uh, so it is don't think that we are all uh, composed from cells yes we indeed we are a colony of cells but we have a frame which keeps our body uh, give our body shape and uh, stability senescent cells enlarge and secrete various uh, inflammatory molecules collectively collectively called the senescent associated secretory phenotype sasp and these molecules uh, stimulate fibrocytes, uh, the cells that produce collagen, uh, a major component of the extracellular matrix. This further increases the local stiffness of the extracellular matrix, which is in turn induces more cells to become senescent and secrete more SASP. Eventually, high levels of SASP attract immune cells such as macrophages. Uh, which are supposed to clear, clear the tissue from dead cell debris, break down excess collagen and eliminate senescent cells. However, in older age, the immune system is often overwhelmed by various challenges and fails to control the excessive accumulation of senescent cells and the development of fibrosis, which is abnormal tissue scarring due to excess of collagen. So this is again uh, cells are getting actually larger, so it is not shown here, but they are getting larger. They are getting more mitochondria, they are getting vacuoles uh, filled with uh, lipids, and uh, they are very active in production of this uh, pro-inflammatory uh, 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 molecules, protein molecules. Nake mole rats uh, are remarkable for their exceptional longevity with a lifespan exceeding 37 years compared to just a few years for most other rodents like mice. New uh, nake mold rats live in hypoxic environment uh, in underground colonies in East Africa and uh, are highly tolerant of hypoxia. These animals have evolved several unique adaptations to resist aging-related uh, pathologies. 
For instance, uh, these snake mole rats uh, have strong resistance uh, to age-related diseases such as uh, cancer and Alzheimer's disease. One of the factors uh, de de uh, contributing to their longevity is the ability to resist the cremation of senescent uh, cells. Oh, pardon, this is, uh, I did remove it. Uh, while they do not accumulate, uh, uh, they should be zombie cells, uh, senescent or zombie cells. While they do accumulate senescent cells with age, these cells do not secrete uh, SASP, which is associated with aging related chronic inflammation. This unique characteristic may contribute to their longevity and ability to resist aging related uh, pathologies. The timely removal of senescent cells has been shown to extend the healthy lifespan of mice and alleviate age-related disorders as demonstrated in this study. So you can click on, on it and read the publication. Interestingly, uh, naked mole rats uh, possess natural mechanism of, uh, for eliminating senescent cells. Uh, specifically, uh, uh, these fibroblasts are part uh, particularly susceptible to accumulation of hydrogen peroxide, this is a reactive oxygen species, in hypoxic conditions, as uh, evidenced by this research. Based on the finding of these studies, it appears that we could potentially achieve longer lifespans by suppressing the release of this SASP through the use of xenostatic or xenomorphic uh, drugs. Additionally, the timely removal of senescent cells using senolytics or our immune system can, could play a vital role. So we, we can use senomorphic so to reduce the uh, concentration of this SASP molecules and for inflammatory molecules, or we can uh, reduce the uh, number of the senescent cells, it also works. For the immune system to effectively eliminate senescent cells, the number of these cells in old age might, uh, must be uh, reduced to a level that is either lower or compa compar compatible to the number of immune cells uh, that's, uh, for, uh, for their destruction, which accounts to approximately 0.1% of the body total cell population. As our bodies age, the number of senescent cells t tends to increase, which results in a decreased rate, rate of their elimination by the immune system. This decline may be attributed to various mechanisms, including the impact of SASP on immune cells, immune system overburden uh, due to autoimmune diseases uh, and uh, an increased influx of pathogens and toxins from the colon, and the stiffening of the extracellular matrix, which hinders, hinders uh, the easy passage of immune cells into inflamed tissues. This ultimately leads to exponential increase in the risk of death with advanced uh, advancing age, as discussed in this uh, research. Okay, so you see the uh, chance of death uh, is, in, is going exponentially, and uh, uh, or, or then uh, actual fraction of the population alive drops uh, consequently. Okay, you see this is the so-called Gompert Gompert uh, model. Okay, so thank you again for your time. I, I did it as uh, short as possible, and I will continue to develop this in more details. So, and if you, can, uh, if you want to support my project, at least you can uh, click button uh, like and uh, bell buttons. Subscribe to my channel, share this video with your friends. And again, it is at least some support what I can get because I don't have any financial official support because my opinion is very much different from official and then this uh, agenda, uh, there is no agenda to improve your health, but trust me. Uh, what is happening is uh, sharp shortening of the lifespan in developed countries and uh, we will see, uh, I believe we will see in, uh, in, in near future um, famine and other uh, war conflicts and other uh, disturbances and a sharp decrease in the uh, population on, on our planet. So and it is, if not to mention the uh, development of artificial intelligence. But again, I'm, I'm not against artificial intelligence. I use it every day and it is big help. But if you will uh, use uh, uh, chat GTP or other uh, chatbots uh, and ask question how to extend your longevity, you will get opinion of the 
World Health Organization, which is again, as I said, absolutely uh, sometimes is opposite, opposite to my opinion. And again, uh, they don't have such a problem to extend your longevity to a thousand years. It, it is just, well, it's out of agenda. Okay, so have a wonderful day. Thank you for your time again. Ciao, ciao.